<laughs> Hello everybody, this is Val with This Is How You Do It. And I am here gonna do some exercise. This is the lady that I'm listening to this morning. And she has inspired me to get up off my behind and do something. And so here I am. I'm going to get on this thing just for a few minutes. I don't know how this is going to work with me on this and talking to y'all. But I um, said I was going to get on up and do something. I'm looking at time. I'm not going to be on here long. This is just there. As if I was outside walking up, going to the Grand Villa. Uh, setting up, you know, plant some flowers, doing something. And this is first thing in the morning. And I think this was probably be better for me. Because I don't really like work, working out around the men. I don't like people watching me when I'm trying to uh, better myself. Because I'm not doing it for them anyway. I'm doing it for me. For my health so that I will feel good about myself when I go outside let's be real in the summer times I don't feel like the biggest bloated thing out there yeah and I did get my nails done people I just painted them no big deal and I'm just talking, trying to burn some time. Y'all always say, fail, that's just one minute. And I'm tired, y'all. Now, I'm real, I'm tired. And I look like a Jaleel with my ponytails. If y'all don't know who that is, that's my grandbaby. And I wanted to show you a D, how you call it? Um... do-it-yourself project that I did, a D, D, T, Y, I guess that's how you say it, project. Now, remember the video that I showed y'all yesterday, where I showed you a glass table with some uh, columns up under it. And I had some coffee tables, one coffee table and some end tables made the same way. Now, I made that very inexpensive. I know it, it looks good in the in the house and against the wall. It looks it looks expensive, very inexpensive. I went to Michaels or Marshalls or or wherever one of those arts and crafts places that they have clothes and perfume, but they still have arts and crafts on in the back somewhere. And they sell those columns. The columns are hollow. Very weak columns. Hollow. Well, what I did was, and they have glass in those places too. I bought two columns and set a piece of glass on it. I bought the glass at, at, uh, at Michael's. And the one, what you're sitting on is what I call my bar. You can use that for whatever you want. Just throw a lot of pictures on it, like a little side table, whatever. But uh, I had a coffee table sitting in the middle of the floor on my rug. And a lady came over one time and said she liked it. I gave it to her. Now, this is a lady that was going through some things. And uh, at that time, the children had moved out. And I had some bunk beds in one of the rooms. And I gave her both of the bunk beds that was in that room. And then I gave her... The bedroom that was in this in the other room and that's how i end up with my weight room um because i had gave away the bedrooms because i had kids so there was beds in there before and then when i gave those two bedrooms away then there was nothing in those rooms so i end up with my my exercise room so um but that lady had been what I told you yesterday, like I was living in a hotel and I was telling y'all about right now solutions. 
Now, I went to college after, you know, the last time I went to college is when Vincent was in the 12th, when Vincent finished 12th grade. So I went to college to be an example to him, to show him that, that go, go ahead on, go to school. So, well, when I went to college, I ran into this young lady and uh, she needed a ride home. I dropped her off at the hotel. This lady had children. Now, I could have ignored the situation that came on back home to my comfortable home, which I didn't say nothing to her right then. And it was cold. And you best believe that I had on a fur, that I had on a fur hat, that I had on gloves with a fur. That's the way Valerie was, was, was going to school. And to look at me, and I had on Patty the Bell suits and things like that. To look at me, she wouldn't have known that I had been through the same thing that she had been through, that she was going through. And I looked at her situation, and I knew exactly what she was going through. Then she didn't even have to tell me. And so the next day, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't ap an approach her right then because, you know, she needed a ride the next day. And I talked to her. And then I asked her, did, uh, how was things going? Or uh, was she looking for a place? She was running from an abusive relationship. She had took her kids and that's why she was living in a hotel. And she had left the whole state and that's why she was in Alabama. And um, she said she had, she was kind of like underground. The people were, she was in transition of getting a place. So when she got her place, it was, it was within that same month. That's when I gave her the beds that was in my empty bedrooms that nobody was using. That was just bedrooms. You know how people have stuff just to say, I got. I had bedrooms in there. Nobody was sleeping in them. So... And the kids had moved out. So I gave her the bunk beds that was in Vincent's old room because Vincent had sleepovers. And so that was two beds. And then I gave her the bedroom that was in the other room. And then she liked my table that was sitting in the middle of my floor. I gave it to her. Gave her pots and pans and dishes out of my cabinet. Gave her all of my pots and pans. I just got some more. I'm talking about right now solutions. I ain't got time to go buy you somewhere. I'm going to give you this. I'm going to give you this. I got this. I got this. Here, 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 here. Willie packed all that stuff on the truck and took it to her place. And um, to me, it make my house look better not to have the, the table in the middle of the floor. It opened the room up. Then I had a chance to get my exercise room. And so what I said I was going to do to the other bedroom is just make me one big old closet. <laughs> but then that didn't work out. I needed a guest room because the kids started coming home for the holidays. And then I ended up getting a bed for my, my neighbor, which is family. You know, they was getting a new bedroom suit. And I say, well, what y'all going to do with that bed? And they say, well, if you want it, you can have it. Just a twin bed. And see how the cycle comes around. When you give, it will be given unto you. And so, those two bedrooms got, got furnished back there. But my thing is, sometimes it don't take a whole lot of money to help somebody. Sometimes you got, got it right there in your bedroom. You got it right there in your kitchen. You got it right there in your house. And if you give that person that, you won't miss it. You won't miss it. I don't miss none of that. I don't miss none of the stuff I gave her. Matter of fact, once I released it, the things I got in return was just as good or maybe even better. And you know what? I've been talking to y'all, and y'all look at the time. Y'all look at the time. And you know when this gets 10 minutes, I'm going to get off this thing. And I'm going to show y'all this table that I was talking about.
Get you a good look at it, a close look at it. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, it's 10 minutes. And I'm going to stop. I'm not going to push myself. I'm, I'm a little winded. I feel a little sweat. But Valerie ain't trying to do all, do it all in one day. She's going to take her time and do it like that. Now, I'm going to sit this on the floor right here. See that? That's a coffee table. I mean, a side table. See this column? See that? I got that for Michaels or Marshalls or whatever you want to call it. Now, I got two up under there. I got two up under there. This horse, don't worry about this horse. This horse is just something I picked up somewhere. Now, the reason I got two up under there, I had uh, an extra little round table, round, round glass table like this. And I had two of these. At first, I just had one up under each table. But because one of my round tables broke, I put two up under here. You see that? But this is hollow. And if you want to paint it, you can paint it, spray paint it outside, it can be any color you want to. But it came white like that. And they had another one. Now, these are what I had up under my coffee table that I had in the middle of the floor. You see the angel? Wait a minute. You see that one right there? That's, that's an angel. Those are little baby angels, like baby, baby. You know, that's the body of their body. It's here three sided. See that glass table? They sell those at Michaels or Marshalls. And you see that black thing in the background? That's the dramatized tapes, the Bible that you're looking at. That black with that uh, duct tape on it. If you ever heard of long years ago, they had the dramatized versions of the Bible where you can hear the ocean and the birds and, and the ark and all the animals getting on the ark and all of that noise and the Red Sea opening up. That's that kind of Bible tapes. But um, I'm going to sit this on the table right here. I'm a little winded, y'all, because I did my exercises, so y'all don't mind me. And you see that table right there? That's my bar. Same thing. Got those two white columns from Michaels or Marshalls or whichever one of them is the Arts and Crafts place. And I bought that glass table from that same place. Those things did not go together. I put those together. And when people come in the house, I get a lot of compliments on that. But that's something I made. That's something I put together. Something I put together. See? See that? Something I put together. And I got these these liquor containers from that same place, Marshalls, Michaels, or whatever it is. It's gone out of business now. That's why I don't remember the name of it. But I got these from that same place. And I put them on here. And I made this bar. This came from the same place. They didn't have all of them. They didn't have the mates. So that's why all of these look different. All these look different because they don't have the mates to them. But yet still, they look like they go there on that table. Now, I didn't have liquor in them before. This is the white liquor, y'all. But we... I don't keep them full all the time. Sometimes I go and fill them up. Fill them up. But then, that's me telling y'all that people look at your house especially on this forum and thank you showing off because it looked like you have some nice things very inexpensive I just have an artistic eye when I saw it I looked at it couldn't afford to buy a coffee table couldn't afford to buy end tables couldn't afford to buy the set for the amount that the people wanted it you understand? When I got those two columns and made my own end tables, made my own coffee table, made my own bar, probably less than $100 or less than $200. But if I would have bought a coffee table, end tables, and a bar from a store that sold that kind of stuff, 
I would have been out of pocket with that. And that lampshade you see behind me, that lampshade came from Walmart. And the, and the uh, lamp that it's standing on, I probably got it at a thrift store. So, careful not to judge people. You don't, you don't know where they come from or how they get what they get. And then again, just because something look expensive don't mean it is. And I'm winning now. I'm going to get my coffee and take you out to another room and do something to my hair. This is, bad, this is how you do it. I'm going to take a breather for a minute. <laughs> and I'll see y'all later. Bye. Child, I got the exercise in. It's done. <laughs>